Hiya, Fitness by Susie. Today it's fighting fit cardio. Uh, we're going to do some kicking, jabbing, going to have a bit of fun. Get that heart rate going, get that fat burning, get that uh, metabolism firing. Get your cans or not. So, basic stuff. I'm not a, I'm not a boxer size or a combat instructor, clearly, you'll see. But we're just going to get going. We are moving already, I hope you are moving too. We need to get warmed up, roll those shoulders, very quick warm up, nothing really, you know, significant because it's cardio, we're not working our muscles very seriously, but we need to do, we need to get that heart rate going up a little bit before we start. So grab your cans or do it with your clenched fists. Your first move, we're going to do a cross jab, we're going to alternate sides. So. For that just keep moving keep hamstring curling keep side stepping whatever you need to do so that i'll show you elbows are tucked in jab it to the cross bring it in jab it to the cross bring it in you're going to go faster than that get ready four three two one jab jab have a little bit of a dip in the middle keep those shoulders down face that palm down And breathe. Pull that elbow into the side, into your side. Yes, we are straight in. If you need a longer warm up, take one on your own. Pause the video, do that, get into it when you're ready. And I don't mean a week on Tuesday when you've had another cup of tea and a packet of Doritos. Oh, crazy description. I'm advertising, no I'm not. <laughs> I wouldn't advertise junk like that. But no, you know what? If you want to eat your Doritos, chuff and eat them. But after this, not before. Four, three, two, one. Sidestep, hamstring curl, march, whatever. Still upper body, still jabbing. This time we're gonna alternate some um, uppercuts. So that means keep keep moving, curl it in, bring it back, curl it in, bring it back. Your hip goes into it, you're going up to about chest level, four, three, two, one. Bring it in, bring it in. Keep those shoulders down. Hold tight to those cans or squeeze your fists if you're not holding on to anything bring that hip into it your full body bring everything into it get your frustrations out better than many ways that we could choose stress relief here we go four three two one and whatever you do don't drop your cans don't let go of them that'd be a stress that needs relieving yeah don't smash any windows or kill any pets or upset any uh, partners let's not do that so i'm going to put the cans down just because it's easier to focus and not worry about holding on to something keep marching you're going to do some basic one two three kick and then the other side get ready four three, two, one, so one, two, three, kick, one, two, three, kick, you kick as high as you can, and you're kicking with that heel, try not to launch too high, and hyper extend that knee, it's not good for your joints, so if you need to, stop just before you get to that point, that'll also bring those muscle that muscular strength and control into it because you're moving with intention. We're going to go from this to a basic alternating kick without the step. Get ready. Four, three, two, one. So kick, kick, kick. I'm moving those arms. I'm leaning back ever so slightly just to balance out that forward kick very windy today if you can hear it i don't know if you can 
and it was raining earlier. But you know, it is February, what do you expect? Four, three, two, one. Hamstring curl, march, sidestep, whatever you need to do, but just keep moving. This is pure, pure cardio, and it's brill. I love this kind of workout. There's nothing technical, nothing complicated. I'd die if I ever entered a proper boxing or kickboxing ring. I'd be laughed out of there for one thing, let's be honest. But this is about fitness, it's about fun, it's not about... No, oh, that's not how you do a proper cross punch or it's not how you do a proper, uh, you know, sidekick or whatever. I don't care! So, as long as I'm moving safely, that's all I care about. So, speaking of which, and not being too technical about it, I'm now going to do a bit of a sidekick. So, I love, I love this move. So, what are you going to do? is then I'm going to I'll get my brain into it, tap, kick, tap, kick, get ready, four, three, two, one, so tap and kick, tap, lean and kick to the side, you kick as high as you can, lean into it and kick with the side of your foot, your foot is flexed all the time, I'll just move, see if you can see what I'm doing there. My foot is flexed, it's not pointed, it's not extended. Nearly there on this side. So, five, four, three, two, one. Just a bit of a sidestep or a bit of a march. That heart rate should be quite high. We're going to do the other side, funnily enough. I'll do it at an angle. Four, three, two, one. So tap and kick. Tap, kick. Breathe. You can lean that arm out if it helps, do what you want with your arms. Really lean into it. Do your best. Are we having fun? Of course we are, this is fantastic. Get your frustrations out. Five, four, three, two, last one. One. Woo! I need a drink. You sip your water whenever you need it, not just when I do or when I remind you, that's up to you. Grab your cans. Keep moving. So this time, we're going to do a bit of a, a combination. So again, don't get, don't get too upset or too scared. It's the most basic of all. It's just not one simple uh, single jab. So what I'm going to do this time, you keep marching. I'm going to step forward, back, step forward, cross it, bring it back. So can you see what I'm doing? That second is a more of a significant. Uh, that first one is just a forward. Get ready. Four, three two one so forward jab step it back forward jab step it back keep your shoulders down remember don't let go of those cans safety first Those palms facing down. Nearly there on this side. Five, four, three, two, last one, one. Keep moving, we're going to go straight into the other side. Get ready. Four, 
three, turn round, two, one. There you go, straight in. Keep control of that movement. Bring that hip into it. Tuck those elbows back in. Really put your whole body into this one. Well, into all of them, really. Come on. Nearly there. Five, four, three, two, one. Keep moving, roll those shoulders. That's a good one, I like that one. Whew. That heart rate is certainly up there now, eh? So now we are going to incorporate those muscles a little bit more. I'm going to put the cans down. We're going to do a squat to a kick. So I'm going to go straight in and show you. So you're going to squat, kick. Squat, kick. Do not have your full squat, you go as far down as you can, but you keep that chest up. Four, three, two, one. Squat, kick. Squat, kick. Sit, sit that bum back. Keep that chest up. I don't care what you do with your arms. You can bring them into, into it anywhere you want or not at all. Kick with that heel. Stick that bum back, go on. All the weight in those heels. Do your best. You go as low as you need. Sorry, as low as you can, or even just as low as you want to do it. It's up to you. Four, three, two, one. Let's just jog. Jog it out, come on. Let's keep that heart rate up for now. I'm not going to pick the cans up for this one because I'm going to go faster. What I'm going to do now is a hook. So I'm going to alternate. So again, I've got me I've got my hands into fists, I've got my elbows in, I've got my feet quite wide, I'm going to pull that arm up, jab it in, so about right in front of your face, and then, oh, did the wrong one, then the other side. So that forearm needs to be more or less parallel to the floor, and your fists are clenched. Four, three, two, one. Shoulders are down. Again, that hips into it. I'm putting my whole body into it. I'm going fast. I'm tensing my arms. I'm lifting that elbow up, but I'm keeping those shoulders down. Come on. Can you hear me breathing? You put what you can into this. Stick that elbow back down as you're doing the other side. I'm going to mess you up, really push it, and we're just going to do some very basic forward fast jabs. Four, three, two, one. Jab, 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 jab. Pull that elbow back, turn that wrist so your palms are facing down. Come on, give it some. Put that body into a little bit, get that sway going. Four, three, two, one. Check it out. Woo! Hecky thumper. Eh? So it's all about. Yeah, <laughs> that heart rate should be very high now. So this is what this is about. We need to bring it down to take it back up, to bring it down. Those intervals are very important. You can't just keep it up there all the time. Just don't. 
not on things like this, on steady state cardio you can. If you're jogging, doing a 10k or whatever, going at the same pace, that's fine. But this is interval training really, technically. So it's the up down, up down, which is excellent for fat burning, etc. Cardiovascular health. So, what's next? I'm gonna go back to those side kicks, but we're gonna alternate. So, what I'm gonna do is kick, kick, kick even more, even less technical, but it works your body. So, four, three, two, one. Kick, kick. Whoa, very unbalanced on this one. But it doesn't matter. I'm working my abs. I'm working my whole body. It's the exact same technique as before on the kick. But I'm alternating. Feel that heart rate soar. Your metabolism will love you for it. You might not love me for it right now, but your endorphins should also be working through your system now. For Three, two, one. I've got to do one on each side. I counted in wrong. <laughs> I do that a lot, have you noticed? Yeah, oh well, never mind. So how are we feeling? Are we loving it? Like I've said, there's nothing technical, nothing crazy, complicated, nothing that's gonna get me signed up by Les Mills or sued by Les Mills, let's, let's be honest, come on. So, <laughs> grab those, actually no, don't, we're gonna do some boxing bags, some, you know, bit of Rocky. Let's get a bit of Rocky on. And while we're doing that, we're gonna do some jacks or we're just gonna march or whatever we need to do. So I'm gonna lift my elbows high, I'm gonna start like this, Hands are in fists, palms facing down. Let's start there. Try not to punch yourself or knock your knuckles together. And if you want to add a jack, let's go. Obviously this is nothing to do with combat or jabbing or kicking, it's just cardio fun. Can you speed it up and not drop those elbows? Bring those shoulders down, get that chest lifted, look straight ahead, reverse that direction. Four, three, two, one. No break really, we're going to go back into cross jabs. Four, three, two, one, jab, jab. Go faster because we don't have the cans. Speed it up, come on. That don't mean you lose the technique. Shoulders down, hands into fists, pull that elbow in. We're gonna have a bit of a blast at the moment for this one. From here, we're gonna go into a bit of a flurry, similar to the uppercut, but we're gonna keep both hands in the middle and circle them round to uh, pull them into your body. So instead of trying to explain it, I'm gonna show you. So we're doing that. That's it slowly. Let's go into it. Come on. Lean in. Squeeze those fists. Come on, make fists. Pull it in. Pull it in. Pull it in. As fast as you can. Four. Three. Two. One. That was nice. I like that. Liar. I do. Do you know what? Me and dolphins are going. I'm happy. I'm in a great mood. I'm tired. I'm ready for the end. <laughs> my wrist strap isn't. My timer isn't. But you know, whatever. Let's do some jacks and a jab. Jack and turn it around into a jab. Last minute decision. Often the best way. So jack, turn it jab. Jack, turn it jab. There, we didn't know that was gonna happen, did we? Neither did I. And I'm the one making this nonsense up. 
told you those old endorphins. Oh, I don't think I'm gonna say hors d'oeuvres then. No hors d'oeuvres, just endorphins. So he's jumping forward with that same foot as that side that you're jabbing with. Four, three, two, one. There you go. Sometimes it's best not to know what's coming up. <laughs> That's my head. My mind rarely knows what's coming up in my mind. So yeah. Come on. Do you know what this is what it's all about? Get outside. I don't care if it's a bit rough, a bit windy, it's been raining, or even if it still is raining. So maybe don't have your phone in rain. So March. Next thing, I'm going to get the cans. Well, I'm going to get a can. So I'm just going to do one side. And it just, I'm going to put the other hand on my hip, probably, or on my thigh. I haven't figured it out yet. So this time, what you're going to do, you're going to dip and go to the side, stand and hit. Jab, jab. So from the front, that's jab, jab to the side. Get ready. Four, feet wide, two, three, two, one. Jab, 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 jab. This is a bit slower. Squat into it, sit into it. Watch where you're jabbing. You're sort of hitting with the outside of your hand where your little finger is. Can feel that. Five, four, three, two, one. Oh yeah. Other side. Swap hands. Four, three, two, one. Now again, like I said, this is quite a slow one. Sit into it. Yes, I'm breathing. It's not for the effect. I'm actually breathing this way. <laughs> Don't lean forward. Five, four, three, two, one. Check it out. Oh heck. Oh heck. <laughs> I had a drink for ages. I'm not going anywhere. I'm not running off. I'm leaving you. I always say it. I will never train anyone harder than I will train myself. And I mean that. That's serious. We're nearly there. Eh? Wow. So now I'm going to do a combination of jabs. I'm going to do front, cross, hook, uppercut. Front, cross, hook, uppercut. Get ready. Four, three, two, one. Front, front, cross, cross, hook, hook, upper, upper, front cross you can speed it up now you've got the technique your speed is entirely up to you you don't have to follow my pace slower faster whatever same pace and if you get mixed up and confused don't worry I probably will as well bring that elbow up on that hook keep those fists clenched all the way through it's starting to rain again. Good job, I'm nearly done. Let's speed it up for the last few rounds. There goes that breathing, that gym breathing. Four, three, two, one. I'm gonna finish the set. Beautiful. 
awesome. Roll your shoulders. That was just under half an hour. That's enough for something like this. Have a nice gentle twist. We need to bring that heart rate down gradually. Not all in one go, because that is not healthy. Keep those shoulders down, twist that body. Hands on your hips, circle it round and stop at the front and go the other way. Circle, circle, a big, big, big circle, as big as you can get it. Now, I need to go because I don't want my phone ruined. Keep moving, slightly. Do what you need to do. Do nice big arm circles. You've worked that upper body, you've worked that lower body, you've certainly worked your abs and you've definitely worked your heart. Bring it down, nice and gentle. And I'll catch you next time. There you go. Fitness by Susie. Fighting fit. Let's all get fighting fit, yeah? And let's do it together. Because it's fun. And a bit awful. No, it's lovely. I'll speak to you later. Bye-bye for now.